everybody, AJ Rizek here, and today we're going to take a look at how to install Conky Theme Manager as well as Conky's onto your Ubuntu-based distribution. Now, if you're not familiar with Conky's, um, basically what they are is you have a little graphical, uh, a little maybe a little widget you'd want to call it that will show up on your uh, display and it'll have all maybe the date, the time, uh, CPU usage, all that kind of stuff. Um, now there's some distributions that come with a default Conky um, and in of themselves Conky configuration files can be a little hard to set up and configure. Um, what this Conky manager is, is it basically gives you a nice clean graphical front end to be able to manage these various themes uh, making a whole lot more user friendly and let me pull over here's an article from um, web update and it's actually about almost a year old uh, but it talks a little bit about you know Conky Manager, graphical front end for managing Conky configuration files, and this was at the time that they uh, there was a new version of the Conky Manager had come out. Um, and here you're looking at some of the different uh, Conkeys that can be added uh, to your um, to your desktop, um, and uh, I'm actually working on a little write-up for on my web page, uh, ariaprime.com, and um, it'll have like a little more detailed instructions on, on how to do the install and various options, places where you can go to get uh, various conky themes. Um, but uh, for now, we'll just work off of this web page or the web update page. And uh, I'll include instructions on, you know, how to do the install here also. But if you scroll down the page, we're just going to go and install this via terminal. And you can, you know, just copy and paste. And I tell you what, while that's loading and unpacking all that, I'll pause the video and then we'll come back and take a look at what we got. Okay, we're back. The installation is done. And actually, while I was at it, I went ahead and added the uh, theme pack. So I had additional conkeys more than, than just what came with uh, the conkey manager. Let me pull it open here. Alright, so you got a list of, you know, a variety of Conky widgets and then themes. The difference between the two is the theme, it includes a new background and, you know, the, the widget and, you know, basically everything. Um, personally, I want to keep my background. Um, I just want the little widget job. Um, and as you can see, you got a big variety to choose from here. Um, and you get a little preview down here. Um, so you can kind of scroll through, you know, all these different themes. Um, ooh, that's kind of cool looking, that one right there. Let's give that one a try. So you just select it, and boom, you see it pops up right there. Um, see, I got my time, date, day, uh, RAM use, CPU use, all that kind of stuff. So, you know, that's pretty cool. Um, and as far as the manager goes, okay, 
you can use these buttons right here to scroll through the various widgets, uh, start and restart a particular widget, stop the widget, go and edit it. You know, you can play with the uh, um, you know the alignment and all that kind of stuff. Now you may be wondering because it's at see where it's at the top middle and I click on apply and it goes over to the um, right hand side of my screen. Um, I'm running uh, dual monitors here and it, and so this you know is essentially the middle of my screen because it's stretched over two monitors. Um, so that you know something to remember if you're a uh, you know multi monitor um, like I am and 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 to be quite honest probably what I will do is um, I will probably move mine to top right which you wouldn't see um, but I do it puts it on the other screen for me and actually that's kind of um, you know the way that I use my screens in that um, this screen right here is the one I'm working like say I'm writing a Word document this is the screen that I've got the actual Word document on the other screen I'll use that for um, having reference material open so you know this you know data that I may want to look at I would probably want to have it on the other screen anyway but you know like I said this is just something that uh, you know to to think about um, you know if you got multi monitors that um, unless you're using a mirrored view um, it takes into account the entire you know stretched um, monitor Well, anyway, so you can do that and you can resize, do transparency, uh, change the time format. So, you know, if you like the 24 hour thing on, on uh, your clock, that sort of thing, all kinds of stuff you can you And like I said, you know, you can, you can have Conkeys on your desktop and not use the Conkey Manager. This is just a graphical front end that makes it a little easier to, uh, um, to set it up and configure that sort of thing. Um, now, like I was saying about the additional themes, there's basically two routes you can go to um, add those extra themes. One, you get this import theme pack so anything that's got this .cmtp.7z, um, you can import it as long as it's in that zipped format, and you know just click it and, and import and, and whatnot. The other way, kind of the manual method, um, like just in case you had downloaded a single conky file from, um, you know, say DeviantArt you go to your file manager go to your home folder and you're going to want to look at you know be able to show hidden files so if you do that you will see a con key folder and so you just copy and paste into here your various um, you know the con key folders with the or the, the widgets and the themes and that sort of thing and then over here in the fonts, if there were, if there's additional fonts that are needed for the Conkey that aren't, you know, part of the default um, Conkey fonts, I guess you could say, just copy them into here. And that's basically what I did when I copied um, the theme pack. I wanted to see if I could go and, you know, and, and move things via... Um, you know just by by working in the folder view and that's what I did I copied all the fonts and and moved them that that method and and whatnot um, I was just you know mainly curious to to see that, that uh, if that would work but anyway uh, yeah it did so I uh, hope you found this video useful 
Um, you know, uh, download some conkeys and dress up your desktop, make it nice and pretty. Um, uh, if you like the video, give it a big old thumbs up, comments, questions, all that kind of stuff. We'll leave it down below as usual. Um, I will try to get my write up on Aria Prime, uh, you know, get it written and loaded up as soon as possible. Um, and as soon as I get that done, I will throw links up. Uh, on this video so that you can go and read the write-up. Uh, and as always, thanks a lot for watching. See you on the next video.